Hello, sir. Hello. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yeah, so I was wondering, you know, this book is obviously based on the Ronald Cross novel, um, <laughs> which I assume that you've read. <laughs> um, so, uh, no, I haven't, but I want to after this film. Um, which is more important to you, the script or the novel? Script. I think because we're making a film that is a film in itself, and uh, as an actor in the film, you have to go off the script because obviously not everything in the book's going to make it and you can't be too precious. But the amazing thing about this film is that it really does do the book justice and there's so much of it that is in there and hopefully the fans who are passionate about it will, will know and recognise everything they see. And how useful was it having Veronica on set? Oh, it was amazing. I mean, she wasn't there every day, but when she was there, she was excited and respectful and she didn't seem to be precious about it. She was just excited about the opportunity to have it made into a film. And uh, It's a humbling experience just hanging out with her because she's such a young, talented person and, and it kind of blows you away how much she's achieved already. Now, some of the more interesting and really secrets I, I enjoyed a lot were the ones where uh, they go into sort of the um, virtual reality trips into their fears. Yeah, exactly. So, if you were to do that yourself, what, what, what would you be facing? Oh, into which faction? Uh, or, oh, which what? fear landscape? Yeah. Probably something to do with heights. Okay. I think so. Yeah, I'm bad with heights, so that would be a bit scary. I'm also afraid of heights, but we can help each other out. We, we, we can work, we can work. Hang on to each other. You hold me, I hold you. Yeah. Just yeah. <laughs> I also wanted to ask, you know, uh, with this film, the, there's a sermon that happens where people, you know, choose a faction to sort of decide, to, to show them who they are. So, I, I guess it wasn't as dramatic as that, but is there a moment in your childhood where it proves that you were destined to be an actor? Ah, oh, good question. I don't know about destined to be an actor, but there were moments where I knew that I, I wanted to give it a go. And I think um, I was very lucky to have parents who didn't kind of throw me out of the house. And I was very lucky to have, uh, uh, you know, teachers at school who supported me. Yeah. Now, a final question. You know, I feel like you know, we just met each other, but I feel like we're bonding, we're becoming fast friends. So, you know, be honest with me, what faction would I be in? Yeah. Right now. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to say candle because you're kind of grey y. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you're candle. And you're honest, man. You tell it how it is. <laughs> Thanks, man. Have a good premiere, right? Cool. Thanks, man. See ya.